Hello everybody and welcome to episode 127 of ASA, my Q&A series where I answer your questions. I have family coming over so I'm recording this video a lot earlier than normal so if I missed your question that's why and I do apologize. So you can always just ask it again in this episode or if you have a different question you can leave it in the comments down below and I will answer it in the next episode. Now let's get into today's question starting with Proj Forever. ASA, which do you think were better, the 2019 LEGO Star Wars Anniversary Edition minifigures or the 2024 Anniversary minifigures. So I do like the 20th Anniversary Edition minifigures. They're kind of just like a little Easter egg. So like for old school fans, that's really cool. But I'm gonna have to go with the 25th Anniversary Edition minifigures. They're basically just minifigures Lego didn't ever think they could put in a set, but that were like, hey, we want to make these minifigures. That's why we got like a Cal Kestis. But I think the 25th Anniversary Edition minifigures are way better. Thank you. I love you. Next question is from Mayo Husco. ASA, which droid do you prefer? R2KT or L3GO? Potatoes. Thank you for the potatoes. So I'm assuming you're talking about Lego because the one is only in Lego. But I just, I don't like the R2KT. I still sadly can't show the picture because it's still leaked image. I don't know if I would get in trouble for showing that. But I'm going to go with the L3GO. It's so cool. Like, it literally has the Lego logo colors. And if you look at the name, it literally spells Lego just with a three instead of an E. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. It's awesome that LEGO was able to do that. Like, they have their own Easter egg minifigure in a LEGO Star Wars set. Like, that's just fun. Are Astromex minifigures? I don't really think so. Next question is from Klumpus ASA. If you could fix one of the issues with LEGO right now, what would you fix? So there is a lot of issues with LEGO Star Wars. I absolutely hate the newer Stormtrooper helmet. They're just hideous and ugly. I don't like the new clone troopers with the helmet holes. I don't like the inaccuracy with the stickers where the color doesn't match the tile. Also, I don't like stickers period but one issue that I think needs to stop right now before it gets worse kind of like nip it in the bud if you will and stop it now before it gets worse is the pupilless minifigures well let's take a look e what the heck is with pupilless minifigures? They look like zombies. It's it's freaky. It's weird. It's wrong. And they need to stop doing this. If I could fix one thing right now, it would actually be that. Even though I like hate the Stormtrooper helmets and stuff more, I want this to stop before it gets worse. This is a load of barnacles. Ah! And the last question is also from Proj Forever. ASA, have you done the Hogwarts house quiz? And if so, what house are you? So I did do it a very long time ago. I ended up getting Ravenclaw and I thought that was cool and kind of fitting. So I was like, hey, that's nice. Maybe I should retake the test. I don't know. But last time I took it, it said I was Ravenclaw. So I'll take it. Anyways, that's going to do it for today's episode of ASA. Thank you all very much for your questions. If you have a question for the next episode, leave it down below and I will answer it in the next episode. I'll pin my favorite to the top which means you get to go first. Consider leaving a like while you're down there and maybe subscribing if you're not. If you enjoy what you see, then hey, why not, right? And the last thing I want to say is if you want to check out my short review of the Desert Skiff and Sarlacc Pit, it's available in the cards. Have a wonderful day, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye!